the right of video. You know what I really hate? But y'all not always in that conversation. What's up, guys? Guess what? Yeah, I'm going to Hawaii. I'm going to Maui with my friend Raylan. Her and her family are staying out there seven days. I'm only staying five days because I just I don't like being home. I wait from home for that long. So I am him. Eddie's. I'm gonna come over and just get your books. We're 28 and um, we are getting ready to go to uh, dinner with Braylon's mom. I was honestly so high on my flight, y'all. I could not even film. I kid you not. I had a, <laughs> I think I had like four or five of those edibles. I don't know why they hit me as hard as they did. Like, it was so crazy. I'm getting ready. I'm about to like do my makeup really quickly. <coughs> L-O-T-D, shade of weight address. I got this little beach bag from Amazon. I got these new sandals on. This Braylon, running late per usual. We're both running late though, honestly, so. Called Amigos, and I got a mango margarita on the on the rocks. Good morning, y'all. So right now it's 9:35, and today is Friday, September 23rd. Um, I finally woke up feeling refreshed. I'm not gonna lie, you guys, I was high all day yesterday. Like I could barely even vlog. That I swear I didn't even take that many. I swear I took like five. Maybe I took six. Anyway, I didn't even do no house tour. I didn't even get to get my take off. I thought that was somebody else behind me because I'm fucking, I don't even know y'all, but my life has been all over the place. We're about to get ready to go to the beach and go have breakfast with Brandon's family. Like I said, this is like a family vacay, so I feel like it's gonna be real wholesome. And that means I can't dress like a slut. But, you know, I'm gonna be good. I'm gonna be good. But I do want to give y'all a house tour. I'm gonna get ready first, then I'm gonna give y'all a house tour. Because I didn't give y'all one yesterday. But I'm mad because now our stuff is already, like, unpacked. And now it's not as pretty. But it's still a really nice place. Okay, guys. So, I think it's, like, 11 o'clock right now. But we just finished getting ready. Bray gave me this top. I don't know where it's from. Where's this shirt from, Braylon? Skims. Skims. Put the skims on. Now she acting like she can. Basically, this little Chinese dragon print swimsuit that I got from Sheen and my Gucci sandals and then I want to take this band off my head and I have my little beach bag I broke this shit yesterday but I'm just gonna finesse and take it with me again today because bitch I need some pictures but yeah it. I just did like a little light beat it'd be it's hot in Hawaii honestly really. we're about to leave now go get breakfast it's a really beautiful day outside okay we are in their hotel room I just want y'all to see how nice this hotel room is So now it's 228. I'm not gonna lie, a lot of time has been wasted. We just left at the liquor store. We're about to go to the beach after. Do you guys have cut water? Yeah, you already know what we came in here for. Oh, they got food. They a liquor store. And they got Korean barbecue. Hold up. This is the store. This is where we should have been. Y'all tried on the rocks. If you guys have, leave a comment on how you guys like them. This is gonna be my first time trying them. Tequila, the water, and the candy. Got the fan because it's hot as balls. No. Okay, ready? Raylan, let's go. Right, Picture right, time, Katie. Right, right. Are you safe with that kid? Wait up! It's fine. I'm not scared. I'm not pussy. Oh, shit. <laughs> video time. Don't do no videos. Just follow us. Yeah, y'all, we just been vibing out at the beach here. My wig is lifting up, but I'm just trying to get some cute pictures. Because I might just change my hair tomorrow. I just wanted to keep this ponytail in because I thought it was going to last. But after the beach, though, our plan is to go to the movies at 7 o'clock. So 
I think that's where we're going straight after this. But we just getting lit. Well, I'm getting lit. I can't speak for everybody else, but I'm getting lit. <laughs> so we just got finished surfing. Yes, I know you guys are probably like, bitch, you was surfing and you can't swim. Y'all already, don't even fucking play like y'all don't know. I do all the water activities even though I can't swim because a bitch is never pussy. <laughs> so Peyton, why don't you learn how to swim? I'm working on it. We met some random nigga at the beach that offered us some coke. He was like, y'all trying to, y'all trying to do some blow? I was like, yes. But we are gonna go take a shot. So I want y'all to see the vibes right now. So he was like, yeah, come back to the party later tonight. I wanna go to the party. Lost there. Wasn't you just talking about getting lit? They're gonna have a different type of lit. It's Rockstar lit. Rockstar lit! That's your problem. We need to experience different cultures, bitch. This is my new friend that I just met in Maui. All right, look, say something, say something. Uh, uh, Mele Kaliki Maka and uh, oh. Holy Maka Ho. You know what Bud Light stands for? Bitch, you don't like it, go home then. <laughs> Where does the go home then come in there? <laughs> Let's go to nachos. You guys know what nachos is? No. I'm about to meet some kanakas. We're about to meet some kanaks. We're meeting some kanakas. I'm vlogging if anybody wants to say hi to my vlog. You guys want to say hi? Aloha. Aloha. Are you a instructor? Great instructor. He said it's weed. You said press what? This one? Um, do you, I'm going to go grab my press. <laughs> So it's 6.48, my hair has definitely given up. We're about to go to the movie, movies and see Woman King. Um, of course, I'm bringing my liquor on the rock. I did change into this little simple gray bodysuit. with ranch and Italian with some fruit. So we are just got to this little outlet. I'm down to like go in places, I don't care, but I just, I'm not an in-person shopper. A lot of people don't like that. Like I'll go in store, but like nine times out of, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> ooh, crap, what if they have some different Babe, we're in America, nothing's gonna be that different. So guys, we're at Tommy Bahama Bar Kitchen. I just got some shots and a drink. You know, we're from LA, so I'm kind of used to turning up all the time. But I think Hawaii is giving more chill, chillaxed, relaxed vibes. Like, not much of anybody is going outside. Oh! <laughs> this is my shit right here. This is my favorite white people song. <laughs> Seven together. Oh my god. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> I'm about to take drunk. this shot vlog. <laughs> Give me drunk. I'm not drunk, bitch. I wouldn't be a YouTuber <laughs> vlog. They be like, hey guys, welcome to the what vloggy vlog vlog. We're back. <laughs> and you're looking at me crazy. I'm looking at you. I wanna look at the drink menu. I wanna go to Greece by the It's table. live. What is this stupid idiot bitch doing? That's what they're gonna say. Cheer it up, We're on an adventure to find the Dirty adventure Monkey. Adventure time. 45, we're gonna go to Dirty Monkey. Braylon is the reason why I didn't tell us to go in the first place. She wanted to go and sleep. I tried to go earlier, but nobody wanted to go. Lie, 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 lie. <laughs>
The bar vibe was crazy. No, that was crazy. Like, you really No, the like, the actually, the bar vibe, everybody was trying to abduct us and take us home. Make us some island girls for real. <gasps> they were trying, to, they were trying, they were trying, they were trying to make us some island girls. Like, I was actually shocked because I'm like, why are they doing this to us? <laughs> no, it was too much at one point. I'm like, it was so much. It was like niggas I'm left like, and right. Like, Y'all, we're back home, yeah. and it's 3 o'clock at this point. All I gotta say is I hate niggas. And I can't even tell y'all why I hate niggas. I just hate them. We we'll back at it again tomorrow, I hate a nigga. So it's 2.15, September 25th. It's Sunday. We're about to go snorkel. I don't know about all that, though. I can't snorkel. Yeah, I'm gonna just be at the beach getting drunk, watching them snorkel, because I'm not playing those games. Because these people, they not no lifeguard. Yeah. Oh, shit. Something tells me Braylon is not gonna be able to help and save me if I drown. actually have a different menu. They have spam. Just checked into the new telly. Hanua Kai. Just kidding, y'all. We are actually about to go to this restaurant called Dukes, which is in this resort that we in. Going to Dukes. Right now it is 721. This pool is nice as fuck. But um we just left Dukes. The food, I'm not gonna lie. Braylon hyped this shit up and made it seem like it was so fucking good. This shit was not that good. I'm not even gonna hold y'all. It wasn't nasty, but it wasn't all that. Braylon's mom is picking us up. Her mom is making spaghetti, which makes me happy because I've been so hungry these past couple of days. I'm about to take these spaghetti leftovers home. Today it's 11.29 and we're going on the road to what? Hana? Yeah, road to Hana. And I'm really tired. So you guys can tell I have zero energy. Getting my workout in for the week. I skipped the gym all last week. I forgot the name of this specific hike, but I'm gonna get it. They're getting in the water again, and I just don't have it in me, y'all. I'm not gonna lie, I'm running off like four hours of sleep. I did not eat breakfast. If y'all don't know, when I'm hungry, I'm not myself. I get irritated real fast. But they're about to jump off this cliff thing. I mean, even if I was getting in the water, I can't even swim, so I'm not even gonna take no risk of trying to jump into some water. Fuck around and die. <laughs> After this, hopefully we can go home and I can get some food, but my flight is tomorrow. Their family vacation is like two extra days. They stay until Thursday, but I'm ready to go home. <laughs> Anything over five days is a push. <laughs> All right guys, so it's nine o'clock. Had to come back home after that fucking long ass hike because oh my God, y'all, that shit was a lot of work, but Shout out to that hike. That was a really nice hike. The waterfalls were nice and it was easy. So me and Bray are off to sneak off to go get some liquor. Well, really it's just for me, but it's my last night. So why would I not? Okay, let me not say why would I not go hard? But the plan right now is to go get some drinks and then come back, get in the pool. Braylon got the bottles. Now we're back on our way to the crib up to get in the pool for like 30 seconds. We're about to go and get in the pool. I just put on my little purple swimsuit. If you hear me right now, I do sound a little congested. I don't know what's wrong with me. I'm not gonna lie. I don't think I'm getting sick, but I think I just got a life problem. We're still not in the pool yet, cause Braylon, it's 10 o'clock. Thanks. She cute though, one off shot. I'm not, I'm, I'm done with the vlog until we in the pool. Good morning guys. Right now it's like 11 o'clock. This is my last day out here. Braylon's 
stepdad it's his birthday today but her sisters made like a really cute little breakfast for him so we're about to eat breakfast don't know what the plans are for today but y'all i swear i'm low-key getting sick i don't know how at this point i need to stop going outside <laughs> Cause this is fucked up. I was just sick like three weeks ago. What the f I dead ass. It's a sign from God to leave this nigga alone. I know it is. But <clears throat> don't ask how I know that. Happy birthday to you. You know what y'all? Let me tell y'all what just happened and then I'ma put the live stream. We was just chilling today for the most part. And then we decided we're just gonna go get drinks. We kind of were just chilling in the pool for a little bit before going here. And this white woman comes up to us and she's like really rude, yelling, basically. Charged at us. Yeah, Come like on. charged at us, like really angry. And so I was drinking, I took like a shot and I thought she was gonna come and say something about the bottle cause it was like a sign nearby that said like, no glass or something like that so i'm thinking like oh she's just gonna say like you shouldn't be drinking or you should have that bottle I, that's what i'm thinking right away or maybe like we were too loud but we weren't loud so i'm like it couldn't be that she's like do you guys belong here i don't think y'all live here she's like i i rent a condo here y'all don't live here y'all don't belong here and when she said like it, at first i was like what the fuck old lady and then she was like you don't belong here and i was like oh, okay she's racist Hold on, y'all. I'm on live. Y'all, she's being racist. Yes, you are. Why are you asking us? Bye, Karen. Turn around. Take your bastard back to your apartment before we ask if you're still. She's only doing that because we're black. Quickly. I'm crying. Y'all, look at racist. You, why you don't think? Twenty one. Somebody else said they were staying here, but you. It's twenty twenty one. Young black girl sitting at the pool. My Let's not yell, y'all. It felt very racially motivated. I'm not gonna lie. She kept like pointing at us and talking about some. I'm calling the police, and y'all are trespassing. And mind you guys, we're staying at this Airbnb. If y'all wanna know, it's called Mahina Surf in Maui. So yeah, just know a racist white lady lives there. The only reason why I didn't get it on camera, and I'm like, dang, I wish I had my camera, but I had left my camera inside to go to the pool because we wasn't doing nothing. We were just chilling in the pool. I was on live though, so that's why I'm telling y'all, I'm gonna input the portion of the live where she said, did the little racist shit because I grabbed my phone and I was just laughing at her, but I'm filming it because I'm like, oh, I'm on live. Like, this is perfect timing, babe. You would think in Hawaii, racism? Don't brown people live here? I mean, they're not black, but still, they brown. We're gonna go get drinks really quickly. And basically after that, I'm just gonna get ready and go to the airport so I can get there at like 9, 9.30. down the hatch and of course I left my ID at home and they won't give me a drink without my ID. Shit like that pissed me off y'all because I have multiple forms of proof of ID. Talking about some we need the physical. I'm about to look up the law. All right you guys so right now it's 7.59 to be 8 o'clock. My flight is 11.59 so I'm probably gonna leave in a little bit because the airport is one hour away. I'm just gonna finish this little bottle uh, for like the next like 15, 20 minutes and then Uber, then hop on my flight and go. I'm honestly hurt because one, I did not get a takeoff video. I didn't get like a takeoff clip because I was so high on my flight here. So I'm sad because I think I, I don't know if it's gonna be a takeoff, y'all. I'm gonna just put a fake one. No, I'm just kidding. But to do my little like overall wrap up real quick. Well, this is not the end of the video just yet, but not gonna lie, I don't think I would visit Maui again. Um, not that anything bad happened, but I went to Honolulu last month. I didn't vlog it, if you guys are wondering. Um, I went to Honolulu for two days and I came to Maui for what, a week? damn near and i just i don't know y'all because i think for one thing it depends on the type of person that you are and it depends on the type of vacation person that you are because it's some people that like to go on vacation and they like to relax they don't want to do anything but just rest 
and then you have vacation people that want to go and live their best life in another city or another country or another town i am the one that wants to go live my best life like i don't want to relax <laughs> i don't want to chill i don't like going on vacations to relax and chill i'm not even gonna lie like i get that though some people will be working 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 don't ever have no breaks don't ever have no time off but i don't have like a regular job so i feel like i'm relaxing all the fucking time like i'm always at home okay let me not say i always be relaxing because i do work 24 7 but it's like i don't have the kind of job where i have to get up and stress and work all day and this and that like i i do stress with youtube i do a lot of work with youtube but everything is in my house in my bed like i work from home you know i feel like this trip was very relaxing very much so relaxing very much so like just chill vacay vibes but that's my thing i like to do a lot of activities so only thing I will say, I didn't get to do that many activities. One, because there's not that much going on in Maui. I'm not gonna lie, Maui is a very chill place. Like, there's no nightlife here. I don't think I found like one club. <laughs> we did go to the bar and it was fun and stuff like that, but it, you know, it was like a different type of fun. But, you know, overall, I did still enjoy myself. It was good vibes. We met good people, except for that one encounter with that racist lady today. But other than that, like, I enjoyed myself. But yeah, y'all, sorry if you're watching this vlog and you're one of those people that's like, oh my God, you should not be traveling there. Go sign a petition bitch i don't know what to tell you niggas be so fucking performative online like i'm not even gonna lie to you like people be caring about stuff online but they don't really be making no moves or doing no actions about it in real life like video's not over i'm about to head to the airport and yeah i just wanted to give you guys my little overall wrap up of how i thought this vacation went i did enjoy myself i had a good time i just wish i did more kind of similar to cancun when i went to cancun i feel like i could have did more but you know it's just important to know who you're traveling with and what type of vibe you want for for your vacation, you know? Because I'm not mad at it. I'm not sitting up here like, fuck, I'm so mad we didn't do more. It's just like, oh, you know, I would for sure come back to Hawaii though. Like, but Maui, no, no, no. Hey guys, so it is 9.54 and I finally got back home. As you guys can see, my eyes are red as fuck, not only because I'm high, but also because I'm tired. I did not sleep on the fucking plane. It was so uncomfortable and I thought I chose a window seat and I didn't. And I'm just so mad that I went to Hawaii and back with no window seat. So I did not get to get my takeoff or my landing. But it's okay, it's okay. I will get that on the next trip vlog. Yeah, Hawaii was beautiful. That was it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure to give it a big giant thumbs up. Comment down below what y'all thought of this vlog. Um, I know this vlog was like super chill. This is like a different experience for me too. Like just going on a family vacation with someone else's family that wasn't mine. Feeling like, you know, welcome. Because I don't usually, I don't think I've ever done nothing like that with like my own family. Like, like me and all my sisters and stuff like that. Because I'm not as family oriented. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys on my next one. Bye!